Hey everyone, let's go ahead and budget for the last week of April. So, full time, I'm budgeting $765. I did receive overtime, I'm budgeting $66 of that. And then for my side hustle, it will be $125. A total amount of income will be $956. So that's what I'm working off for this week. The first thing we're going to look at is this part. So rent $150. So now I'm fully funded for the rent at $600. Going on to water bill. That's getting $25. So now I have $100 fully funded for water bill. Moving on to T-Mobile. This week it's only going to be getting $60. Total now $270. So that's now fully funded. Moving on to insurance. That's getting $40 this week. And then we should have now, this should give us $130 in that envelope fully funded for insurance. Moving on to subscription. That's now getting for this week $5. So now we're fully funded for subscription. Moving to debt bills. So for debt bills, I am budgeting $160, but I'm only going to be stuffing $60 should give us $280. Now we're going into our cash expense uh, category. So as usual, it's getting $35 for gas for a total amount of $100. And on to groceries. Moving on to toiletry, this week it's getting $10, so we should have $30 in the envelope. Going on to kids, getting $35 this week for a total of $70. Buffer, that's getting $5 per usual for a total of $10. So we're going into self funds now. For a total of $132 should be in there. And that is it for that. I will be budgeting around $74 for my savings challenges. And then of course $17 is going towards my 52 week challenge. So that's it. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you next. I'll see you in my second fund video. Bye.